Hey guys, welcome back to my brand new channel. Have a look around, like what you see, yeah? All good? Great. Let's get into the video. So if you're new here, or if you've only been following me recently, or you've just come across this channel out of thin air, let me tell you a few things about myself first before I get into this whole what happened to my old channel business. So let's go. Number one. I live in the UK, in England, in a county called West Sussex, in a little town, or well, quite a big town actually, called Worthing. Number two, I was born with a physical disability called osteogenesis imperfecta, and I use a manual wheelchair to get around. Number three, I absolutely love shoes, like, if, if I could shop for anything, I'd love to shop for shoes. Not that my wallet allows it, but I'd have to say my go-to shoe is either a Vans Old School or a Nike Air Force One. Like they're just such a, a fresh design. Number four, I am an athlete. I compete on the track and on the road as a wheelchair racer. And number five, I identify as queer. And number six, let's just throw it in there just because this is a random video and I want to fill it with interesting introduction stuff. Um, I love chocolate, I love food, I'm a huge chocoholic and if I'm like bored for just a second you'll probably catch me looking at like imported snacks from like all around the world. <laughs> so that's the introduction done, let's move on to why we are in this new space, this new channel. So when I first had my old channel someone had set up like the whole like Google Suite thing um, and that was like a, a Christmas gift. Or something that was like a gift for me which was really cool because I didn't really know how to do like all of that stuff and I was getting like a personalized email and website and all that stuff so some, someone actually did all that for me and then it's been like you know a couple of years since I've had that and this person's just doing other things and I wanted to take control like of all that stuff myself and in that transfer somehow my YouTube channel got deleted which was like absolutely soul destroying. I was so gutted when I realised that, that that channel was gone, <laughs> especially since I didn't have like a backup of most of the videos that I had. And it did, you know, there wasn't a lot on there anyway, there was probably like 10 of that. But there were, you know, I'm not, I'm not like someone who vlogs on, on YouTube for the sake of vlogging, like there were meaningful um, videos that I've made, like, you know, about like the Genetic Alliance and I made a video about my, my buddy Mark who does like a lot of fundraising and he took on this challenge to do like parkrun in a wheelchair which was like really sick so we made a cool video about that and um, just yeah lots of other cool things which meant a lot to me and I'd like to think meant a lot to like other people that watched it so was gutted to lose most of that I've literally only got I think two videos that I found on my on my laptop so I mean it's, I guess it's good to at least have them two and I'll probably upload them, maybe, or recreate them in the future. So look out for that. But yeah, that's what happened. A huge blow to have lost my YouTube channel. And I think when when you've been like knocked off that that peg, when you've just like lost this huge thing that like you were building up, it's kind of it's hard to like get back to that. Obviously, like. As an athlete, when I'm not training, there's like so many, there's a billion other things that I might be doing. And to take a bit of time to think about how I come back to this platform. Um, just, yeah, I wasn't ready for it then, but I'm ready for it now. And I think especially like this year, 2020, has obviously been a crazy year for, for all of us, for sure. And I've had the honour through being like a Stonewall sport champion to have so many conversations that I would never have otherwise had and I've been finding like my feet and, and finding my voice and just feeling a lot more like confident in sharing more about myself online and just being like truly authentic because I want to I want to be able to like share my lived experience so that it might help other people like that's it. That's like literally the the gist of of my presence online. It's it's just trying to be an encouragement for other people, whether you have a disability or you are LGBTQ LGBTQ plus, whatever it is. Like 
we all have like different things about us and we all have struggles and hurdles to overcome and I think it's it's just kind of nice to be able to to share the the tough times and like the moments where we might feel like us basically so yeah that's what this space is so I think I'm just gonna yeah that's that's all I'm gonna say for this video I think I'm just gonna wrap it up right there if you are watching this and you've come this far please do subscribe if you can um, it really helps like the channel grow and obviously like to see your support means a lot I appreciate you all right that's it have a great evening catch you next time